What's happening beautiful gamers, Blank here and welcome to another first impression video with Crypt Custodian. Now this game is a metroidvania pretty similar to the old school Zelda games that were on like a 3D type of system. Recent games like Tonic or Death Door might like click a little bit more. This is one of those games where you are going to be exploring a vast world and as you explore you defeat enemies, you try to achieve something. And while you're trying to do so, you find yourself in a place where you acquire new powers and with those powers you go back and you get everything that you need to be able to get all the items and all the goodies and become stronger. <laughs> Anyways, Cryptostorian is a charming metroidvania about cleaning up the afterlife. We're gonna play as Pluto, a mischievous cat who has died and he was sentenced to be the Afterworld's janitor forever. Hang out with other Doom Ghosts, Battle Beasts, and explore a vastly expansive landscape. There is no much like goal as to what is it that we have to do. And that I think is gonna be the intriguing thing about this game, which is discover the plot, other than to having to clean the whole world. But anyways, with that said, let's just jump straight into this game and let's see what Crypt Custodian has in store for us. Let's do this, guys. Hello? Hello? <laughs> Just a group of the eye. Oh, you're awake. Name is Pip, and I will be your guide to the palace. Wait, am I dead? Is that what's happening? Wait, uh, wait, what? Yeah, oh, my name is Pluto. Nice. The palace, I was literally just outside of the street. Where am I? Yeah, exactly. I mean, you, I think you just got, you know, like when the when the big truck just comes in and you're on the way, like, yeah, that your brain just, yeah. Oh, well, the palace is the most beautiful part of the afterlife, but you are not there yet. See, that's exactly what I'm talking about. This is just the entryway. It's where all the new ghosts freeze first land. Ghost, whoa, am I dead? Oh, yeah, sorry. I should have, maybe I should have begin with that part, huh? Well, don't worry much about that. Uh, we just, we just gotta get moving. Sure. Nerva is Kendra. She's the guardian of the afterlife. You'll have to make your way to the, her chambers, and she will listen to your life story and determine whether or not you can enter the palace. So pretty much whether you can enter heaven or hell. God goes to the palace, where they experience never-ending bliss. Bad ghosts are banished to live outside of the palace for all eternity. Come on, you should get going. Something tells me that I am not gonna be inside of the palace no matter what. This is an interesting way to like design a game. Like it moves really interestingly, and then also you have like the 3D type of aspect of it, which I think is pretty cute. I'm so happy to see another cat come here. I mean, in spite of the circumstances at least. Most of the ghosts who come in here are bugs, which doesn't really give us much to talk about. Wait, why are... Oh, <laughs> that would make a lot of sense, right? Like humans, they see a bug and it's just like, black, goodbye. Oh, you can jump. Oh, I like this. I like this. Can you make a big jump? Can you jump outside of the... Ouch. Bad beginning. Don't jump outside of the water. Lesson learned. And what is this about? I guess something we will learn eventually. So far, I'm gonna say it. The music that is playing and the the game itself, I mean, the music sounds pretty good and the game looks astonishing. Like, for a, being a simple game, it looks really pretty. And I'm liking the design with the fishes in the background, like, they just move in non-stop, you know? That's kind of cute. You can actually open up the map. How? Here it is. There you go. 
Okay, I like that. I like that. How do you... How do you make it... So, how? Why? So, what is... Like, inside of the... Palace? Oh, well, I'm actually not sure. I've never been inside. Yeah, I knew that this motherfucker was one of those that was evil. Evil, I say. You... Wait, wait, did you do... Yeah, exactly. You bad or something? I guess I must have been because Kendra said so. But instead of banishing me to the outside of the palace, she sentenced me to be a guide for all eternity. You see, Kendra can be very strict, but also very fair. She makes the rules and she always sticks to them, no matter what. Okay, so... I think I'm gonna end up being a, an evil cat and I'm just gonna clap the, 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 the Kendra's cheeks because why not? Let's see what else is going on. But yeah, I have a feeling that that's exactly what's gonna happen. Let's see. Why is... Is that a... Is that a cleaning bucket? It's a weapon! A broom! Swing it by pressing... Okay. But... I have a little problem. This is not... This is not for a broom. This is for the mop. So why would you have a broom in a mop area? That's weird. Oh, what the freak? Yo, are you sure we're a normal cat? Because this guy, look at that. Look at the damage. Oh my god. Yo, I'm telling you straight up. This is a little bit... Oh, and you can dodge. Oh, oh god. Oh god. Oh god, look at this. Jump and hold, oh, boy. Hey, Kendra. I don't know if I'm evil or not. But even if I'm good, I'm going for your ass. Anyways, which way should we go? Can I... Fuck. No air dash either, so I guess we will get an air dash at some point, maybe? Oh, I think what's gonna happen is that Kendra was... Not kidnapped, but maybe she disappeared and it's gonna be your goal to find her? So then she can decide if I'm good or bad, or maybe I'm neither. I'm like on a neutral ground. And uh, based on everything that's happening, maybe she's gonna be like, yo, it's gonna be your mission too. Well, it's called Crypt Custodian, so maybe I'm not so good, but Kenny is gonna give me the mission of like protect the, the whole world. And by protecting the whole world, she's probably gonna like be like, yeah, listen, you protect this place, that's gonna be your mission. Uh, it's either that or you cannot die. Your call. Well, just like that. But not like with actual death, more like you just, you know, you destroy everything and that that's it, doesn't matter. But actually, I'm pretty happy that this game, the demo actually came out. Honestly speaking, I have been... Like, I, this game has been on my radar for a while. And, um... Okay, let's speak with him and let, then we can keep talking. If I forget, you guys can remind me. Hey, you made it. Kendra Shamir is right inside of here. Just be on your base behavior because you really don't want to be on her bad side. Okay. Good luck, sure. Yeah, I mean, one of the... What was I trying to say? Yeah, so this, this game reminds me a lot of Tonic and Death Door. And honestly speaking, Death Door was one of my favorite games. So, yeah, she's not there. Oh, there... Is that you? Oh, hey, cutie! So nice to see another fresh face around here. I'm not, I am the famous Kendra, guardian of the afterlife. It is my job to determine whether you've been good or bad. Oh... I'm sorry that you died, and now that, by the way, that just makes me so sad. This over here is the door that leads to the palace. Those allowed in the palace never experience a never ending bliss. If you've been good, I'll let you inside. And this door takes us out of the palace. You really do not want to be sent to this door. Well, enough chit chat. Let's take a look at your life. Holy bad news. Bad news. Oh, this says that you were born as a stray and your you had a brother and a sister. Oh no, it's coming. So cute. And then it seems like you were adopted by a nice couple and they took really good care of you. You love to play and get pet. Wow, 
I'm having a really good feeling. No, no, the evil part is coming. Here it comes. Uh, can you please prepare the palace door opening? No, 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 don't do it just yet. Anyways, let's continue. And then, one night. Seems like you escaped from your home, ran onto the streets and... You poor thing. Well, I guess that settles it then. We are going down, because you, you ran away from home. You were a very good cat. I have no choice but to let you into the palace. Or, wait a second, ha ha ha. Seems to be another peach. Oh no. I didn't do that on purpose. I had no choice. <gasps> the little shit tricked me. I think the little shit tricked me. No. No game, don't you dare. That after you died, you landed here in the palace and smashed some of my statues? Oh, fuck. This is just awful. This is not on me. This is not on me. This is on that little shit. Don't blame it on me. I'm afraid that you have been a very bad cat. And as punishment, you will be banished outside of the palace for eternity. Wait a second. I didn't mean to do it. I just thought that's what I was supposed to do. Huh. You thought you were supposed to break my statues? Sorry, that excuse is not gonna cut it. I do feel for you though. If you think this sucks for you, just think about how I feel. I'm the one who has to live with the guilt of sentencing you to eternal torture. This is really bumming me out. Well, enough wallowing. It's time to go. Oh, and because you created such a mess, I'm also sentencing you to be the afterlife's janitor forever. So hold on to that broom. Now it's time to leave. Please exit on the door to your left. I'm not digging that. No, fuck this. Fuck him up. Fuck him up. Fuck him up. Come on. Sorry you didn't make it. I really thought you could do it. It's your fault, little shit. Wait, is there anything I can do? I really don't want to be doomed forever. Sorry, little guy. That's just the way that it works. <sighs> if I just led you into the palace, that would be totally unfair to all the other ghosts I doomed. Fuck you. Fuck you. Can I? I'm gonna, I'm gonna smash you. Come on. You know what? You don't like... Ah, you don't like that? How about this one, huh? Ah, 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 ah. You don't like it, yes? Piece of shit. Now I'm leaving this place, but I hope... That you don't get any of those recovered. Bye, bitch. Wait. So now we're going into a new area. Wait, why, why, why is that? Oh, wait. I can't... What the freak? Oh, shit. Wait. Why am I collecting materials? Is this like a currency or something? Well, it's interesting. I have a dodge. But it has a cooldown. So keep your eyes open for that. You can break everything. Is there anything that you can find by destroying it? I don't know, man, but I'm super pissed at everything that just happened. And I'm just going to be breaking out of the statues because fuck that. No, 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 no. You stay away from me, you piece of shit. Listen, I just got doomed. I don't have time to mess with you. Rude as fuck. You're just showing up in there and be like, <gasps> friend, you friend. I'm sorry. Nah, 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 nah. I'm pissed right now. Okay, what else is in here? Oh, God statue. Listen, I'm trying to clean it, but it's not working. Fuck. Anything behind it? Not really. Fuck. Wish I would have been able to destroy it. That way I can keep showing that cat. Oh, what is this? Save, teleport, or equip. Oh, okay. Save. And then you have a teleport, so we're gonna be able to go to different places, which honestly speaking, I'm I'm kinda I'm kinda into it. Okay, like that's that's actually pretty cool. Anyways, let's cancel this and let's see. What can I do if I open up the map? And I'll go straight, we're gonna have to go left or right. It seems like left might be a good solution for us. But now what is it we're gonna encounter? What happens if I keep waiting? If I open up the map, I can keep going down. Like, you see everything. Like, we can go straight up and then connect there. But then if I go down, it might be, like, the correct slash incorrect path. Huh. Uh, okay, well, no, this is the correct path because it's telling me where to go. That's fine. Uh, boss fight? Or not boss fight, but more like gauntlet. Piece of shit, get out of here. Hiya! Oh, wow, he touched me! Dick! Dick! 
No. Oh, you got assos. Oh, baby. Ah. Ah, let's go. This game is really really aggressive. Oh my god. Really aggressive if you ask me. Shoot everything. Beautiful. Yeah. Oh. Now do it again. Ah, piece of shit. Come here. Ha 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 ha. Give me all that cash. Oh yeah. Now I'm gonna go from being the janitor of the afterlife to the bully of the afterlife. I'm gonna make sure that that guy over there regrets ever sentencing me to like whatever it is that he sentenced me. I'm gonna show everybody. Like, that guy is probably feeling like, haha, my brother runs the underworld. There ain't no way anybody's gonna be able to be on his way. Ah, oh, you think you can hit me like that piece of shit? But little does he know that I am gonna be the new ruler of this place. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Is that all you got? Piece of shit. Now, how do I wanna go? Go through the top or the bottom? Fuck this guy. I can avoid everybody. What the freak? What a show by that boy. Okay, we can go down. Touch that shit. Mother. You see, I'm gonna give them credit for that. That was incredible. Like, they're actually not that weak. I guess I'm gonna have to... Like, the thing is that I was actually also scared. Did I lost anything for dying? Probably you cannot make that jump. I just needed to check. Like, there, I haven't been able to find anything to recover my, my own health. So, I'm a little bit worried about that. Take a look at your items. Uh, not really. Oh, what, what a shot. Let's go. So, okay. So, okay. I understand. So, if we're going to do this, you have to, like, be super careful. Because those guys are going to shoot at you. Let's go. And if those guys are going to shoot at me, they're going to try to mess up with my day. What about you? Some shit. Let's go. So I'm understanding now. They they aim at you. They shoot at you. They try to mess up with you. And there's nothing that they can do. This is all blocked off. So there's nothing that we can do in here. You can go down. Keep exploring this area. It's going to connect to a section that goes through the behind. Hmm. That's some sort of shortcut. Not really. Piece of shit. So if I dodge. And I start hitting. Right away, I can win. However, if I don't start hitting right away, then I'm gonna lose the battle. Good it, got it, got it, got it, got it. What else do we have in here? Let's see. I wanna see what I'm gonna do with all of this cash, game. Come on, give me all that money. Talking about that, I have a question for you guys. So this is something a little bit controversial, I think. I'm not sure, maybe. Maybe I'm using the term wrong. But, so... I was, I've been, I've been, I've been, oh, there's a key. Ra oh, the key is because there's two locks in here, so we can warp back. But now there's things to explore. Anyways, so, I have been, so I'm always, I'm always taking a look at new games, and I'm always, like, playing with friends, and things like that. So, turns out that there's this game, he, it game is pretty gorish, like, extremely gorish, gorish to the level of, I'm gonna rip your arms off. That's how gory the game is, right? And I was like, oh well, that's that's not so terrible. Sure. Let's 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 play this game. And I was playing it with some friends. And um the strange part was that they were super okay with like the super gore of the game, but then they were weirded out about words like fuck or shit. They were like, yo, the language, and it's like, wait a second. We're playing a game where you're literally ripping people's arms off. And that's okay. But it's not okay to like say fuck. How does that work? Somebody translate for me. So anyways, I was wondering if that is like... 
I was wondering if that is like normal, if there are some people that are more sensitive to language than to visuals, or what's the deal with it? Because when I was speaking, I was a little bit confused. Um, I, was, I, 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 I always figured, okay, if you are not, if if you are not sensitive to like gore, then words shouldn't be an issue. But then I guess I'm wrong. So I'm not sure. It was it was just an interesting an interesting experience, and I was like, huh, okay, sure. Anyways, just wanted to hear you guys' thoughts about it. Like, like, I don't know, what's what's the deal with it? Do you guys experience something similar or not really? Right. So I can open this up and it's gonna take me somewhere. I don't really wanna go there. There is more places that we cannot access. I wanna explore the other area. Maybe I won't be able to explore it, but maybe I will. Oh, fuck these guys. No, 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 listen. Stay away from me. Oh, in the dick. Do it again. No. Oh, yes. It feels really good, actually. Like, every single hit that you do in this game. Every single impact, like, the connect. Oh, by the way, this, is, this seems cool. Okay, it seems like there's no way for me to make that jump. Like, that's not happening right now. But whenever you're hitting enemies, there is... It's not like, oh yeah, it feels good to like be hitting somebody with a broom, but there is something whenever it connects and you defeat the enemies, it feels really good. It's a crowd, just like in Death Door. Icon Major Market adds an icon to your map, which tells you where to go next. Item Market marks the location of an item on your map that you missed from a previous run. Fuck that. I like this one. Wait, but is this like a permanent thing? Like, does that happen all the time, or is it just, like, for this room? Oh, that old thing. Wait, I didn't say that I wanted to speak with you yet. So, what you're doing is a little bit rude, Mr. Chicken. It works, but I've lost all the discs. If you find any, you can bring them back and we can play them. Sure. There's a rat. Hey kid, welcome to the Sinner's Inn! How's it going, buddy? I mean, kinda of bad actually, I just died and got sentenced to clean for all freaking eternity. How about I don't wanna do that shit? Haven't we all? Well, if it makes you feel better, it's actually not too bad in here. If you ask me, us bad ghosts are more fun anyways. Okay, sure, are you sure about that? Doesn't sound like it, doesn't seem like it either. I'm Marla, by the way. I sell all sorts of things here, so whenever you collect enough garbage, make sure to stop back in here and buy something. So that's garbage, not stones, okay. And I'll tell you what, it's a welcome gift, I'll even sell you your first special attack at a massive discount. If it is not zero, then I don't want it. Any money spent is unnecessary. It's called the super sweep, go and pick it up! Ah oh, fuck, I spent my money unnecessarily, shit! Hard capsule, that's nice. Increase your movement speed, this is key. Makes attacks 30%, that's good. And creates a circle around you that hurts nearby. I freaking love that. Anyways, give me, wait, wait, what does that do? Creates a spirit circle of brooms around you. What? Sure. Both special attacks and upgrades need to be equipped to save shrines. There is just one outside. When you attack enemies, the vessel at the top left top of your cringe will fill up. When it is full, just press 0 and remember to head to the nearest shrine to equip the new attack. You can teleport between shrines, so be sure to come back and visit whenever you collect more garbage to spend. Trick game made me spend money for no... I guess the game was expecting me to like, tag to that chicken before anything else, but man this feels bad. So much money wasted. So equip... Oh, so you just have to... Okay, you just have to click on it and now we can trigger it. Okay. Now, can I speak with a rat? Do you have anything to offer for me? Maybe? Sorry, bud. I cannot let you in here. This area is for VIP only. And I've never seen you before, so I cannot... You cannot be that important. Now, scram. Betch. And then... What the freak? Hey, is that you? Hey, bestie. Fuck you, Kendra. So funny to see you. You don't know? Fuck you. Oh. Yeah, I was gonna say the same. What are you doing here? Don't you live in the palace? I sure do, but I like to come in here and see how all the bad ghosts live. It keeps me humble. 
Oh, by the way, I was wanting to talk to you about the whole me dooming you for eternity thing. I just wanted you to know that there's no hard feelings on my end at least. So I was hoping you could just get over it. Fuck you, Kendra. Alright, of you. Fuck you, Kendra. Fuck you. What do you mean by off you go? What do you mean by no hard feelings? I'm gonna... I'm sorry, guys. I'm, I'm not, not getting over this. I'm, I, I, I hope that that's the final boss of the game because I want to fuck her up. Like, I hope that my whole goal is not to, like, keep this place clean, but to collect as, like, be as powerful as I can so I can challenge Kendra and I can be the new ruler and, like, not freaking get upset at people for, like, not tricking people into, like, the, 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 the doomsday just because they decided to, like, whoop some ass. See? Really, Kendra, for half? Uh, what? The, the motherfucker advertises itself! Dick! Sorry. Now, what are we doing here? Let's see. Some bottoms, some big jumps that we can do. Anyways, what's even the point of coming here? Ah. Oh my god! Gauntlet again. Bring it on, bitch. Ah! No! No! Bitch, come on! Let's go, and now it's your turn, little shit. Oh, whoa, there's too many. Okay, that's one. Dodge one. Dodge a single one. Third one. Let's get into business. Let's go, baby. Yes! Destruction to everybody. Ha! Look at all the cash that we're getting. Oh shit, I should have used my power. Wait a second, where am I going? No, can I zoom in? Oh, here we go. Wait, it could have come. So, top and then left and then... Fuck! Okay. I'm still a little bit like curious as to what happens when you die. So this is the little shrine. That's to go to the top. We don't want to do that. We wanna go to the left and see if there is any... Oh shit, we cannot make that jump. Come on! Wait, can I go around though? Oh yeah! Is that a new power? A new skill maybe? Spirit discover. Oh, it's a little cat that got locked in! Kendra! You dick! Locking my friends up like that? Like, who do you think you are? Sorry. Moving forward, you gotta remember, Kendra is the one that doomed me for eternity, so... Anything that happens, and everything that happens is literally its full. So... Yeah, ooh, a chest. Maybe a new power? Defeat a horde of enemies without taking damage. Fuck yes! Fuck taking damage! Oh, ho, ho, that was good! Are these the enemies that you're gonna send my way? Yeah! Do it! Oh! Bitches! Bitches! Bring it on! Nope! Ah! One more hit! Oh yeah, give me the reward! What is that, garbage? Upgrade slot! Collecting upgrade slots allows you to equip more upgrades from a safe shrine. Your chocolate takes up a specific number of slots, and now you have five. Thank you for letting me know how many do I have. I think I need it. But that was good. Like, a little reward for, like, just whooping some ass? Oh, that's the best. And what is that? There is a dead fish in the background. It's not able to, like, move too much. But it's pretty big, and it doesn't really come to the other side, so... Not even sure what's the point of it, but that's fine. We could go to the right and then make way to the middle. We can explore the left. How am I supposed to know it? Oh! So I think, right, because I think the fast travel is open since the beginning of the game. So it doesn't matter where you go, you can always like do the fast travel. You're gonna really try to shoot at me, you little shit. Do it again. Come on. Your turn, come here. Ha! Ha! I told you guys. There is a point where. Whoa! I didn't even hear him pulling the bow. Who's that master archer trying to fuck my day? Ha! Definitely not you. I hope. Because if it was you, I'm disappointed at your skills. 
So yeah, from here we can connect to this whole area and then there's more exploration to do. Honestly speaking, I'm a little bit if out right now about the whole because it's always nice whenever the games give you guidance i mean of course too much guidance is unnecessary but right now it's not like there's no guidance it's a little bit worse than that it's like i'm not even sure wait what is this but a second this connects here but we come from here so how is it that i didn't come here oh because i decided not to go from the top and then this connects oh. So we can know that we're in some sort of like afterlife. I don't like when enemies respawn, by the way. That's not my thing. But anyways, it doesn't really matter. You guys know the drill. If a new enemy pops up, that enemy will be defeated because it's just the way that shit works in this world. Not everything. Everything has to be the way of the... Whatever way I decide. Anyways, fuck you, Kendra. Let's keep going around. Let's see what else we can find out. Big enemies don't respawn. Okay. You had a key! Oh fuck! I forget, you have a dodge for a short period of time, so... Dick! There's one more! Hello! Bye! Open up that gate for me, and we have 1,000 gold! Not gold, garbage! That's fine! Look at that, just come and give me all of that! I really want to see the scope of all of this exploration because now this opens up but does it mean that i could i can go here because i just defeated them and it allows me to go straight yes wait yeah yeah yeah. because this little shedding here it's a garbage and then from here we go up and then there's so much exploration to do to the right but i'm pretty sure all of this is gonna start breaking so it's gonna be like oh yeah you have to be super careful or like super keen like, you can go one way or the other. Each way has its own challenge. I understand. But what do we get if you come here? Trash? A CD! Let's go! Give me that. A sinner's bar. Let's go. Wait. Any point on coming here? Right. So, yeah. You see, if we go from here, we get another thing. But we're going to go from the top so we can explore that section. And, um... The only thing that I'm hoping right now is that the game at some point allows me to get a new broom. Fuck. Fuck. I don't like this. Let it shine. Let it shine. Goodbye. Bring it on. Bitch. Yes. Oh. Ahaha. You really thought you were going to be fucking me up. No way. That's not happening ever. Nope. Stay away from me. Let's go. And you die. Oh, wait. There's two more. Do it. No, no happening now. Mm. <laughs> That's so good. Everything replenished. Take a look at your... Oh, what the fuck? There is more things to do at the top. Oh, shit. This is a full-on castle. Pearl Shrine. I just want to find a... Hello? Hey. What's up there, buddy? Uh, are you Pearl, by any chance? Hey, sorry to scare you. Yeah, that's Pearl. I was just... Up in the rafter, sweeping up some grime. Oh, so everybody that dies has to sweep for it. Okay. This whole cavern is a shrine dedicated to Pearl, the most beautiful frog to ever live. I am a bit embarrassed to see it get so dirty, so I'm trying to clean this whole place up. Oh, so you're a janitor too? Nope, I'm just a frog. But Kendra did sentence me to clean the afterlife for all eternity. She actually sentences everyone to that same fate, although most other ghosts just stop cleaning after a while. Well, anyways, my name is Pebble, and I'll be around here cleaning just for a bit, so I'll see you around. I really think that that little shit, Kendra, don't, it's like he doesn't really sentences you he he like does this on purpose so that way everybody has the same freaking because she can have she wants to avoid everybody from like having a happy life Shit, what a dick i use the wrong power hello there pebble so it's nice to come here and skip the rain little shit you think i don't know what you did what can i get for you um honestly speaking right now 
Spirit Shield gives you invisibility. Not really. We want moves your speed, movement speed, spirit bars. Creates a circle around you that hurts nearby enemies. I like this. Fresh start, but I like fresh start better. Fuck, I'm missing some cash. Shit. Okay. We'll work on that later. Now we can go here. I'm gonna go through the middle so we can explore other stuff. That's kind of nice to see. And yeah, there's definitely gonna be a power that is gonna allow me to like roll faster, not fast. Yeah, but like have less stamina consumption whenever you roll. Because right now the delay is a little bit too steep for me. Yeah. Nope. Don't touch me. Bitch. You really trying to bite me? Okay, I need to see also a little bit more variety of enemies, although so far the game is starting and there has been like six different types of enemies. So that's actually pretty impressive, I gotta say. Talking about that, I don't even know when this game is supposed to be coming out. I just know that if this is what the game is playing, I wouldn't mind like playing this on full release. Like the gameplay is really nice. The gameplay is, the gameplay is pretty smooth and um, I really like this. Wait, why is it that we didn't go over there? Oh, because we cannot make that jump? Ah, so now we come all the way here and we're blocked off. We couldn't go through the top. No, we could. Yes, we did. Wait. What is... We didn't come here, did we? The fuck? Enemies will create a dangerous blast upon death. Defeat 15 enemies to remove the curse. One upgrade slot. Yes. Wait, is this supposed to be a roguelike or something? I don't think so. Okay, so taking a look at this, we cannot really go that way, which is unfortunate. And we cannot really go down. We did get a curse, which we don't really care about. I mean, enemies, it's gonna be easy. But I guess from now on, we're gonna have to ignore that until we have like a double jump. And then... Oh, we can put a marker. Let's go. And then we're gonna have to go to the pal. Okay. Sure, makes it easy enough. Let's go there. Little shit! Let's go. Oh, God. Oh, shit. Oh, that explosive. Jesus. What was that? Okay, we don't want to do any gauntlets while that's going. Yeah, that thing is disgusting. Oh, shit. Explode. It doesn't damage the enemies, too. Huh. I'm curious. I, I do not know if it actually damages enemies or not. Oh, and by the way, hey, what, what am I doing? I can just... Do oh, fuck, this is so good. Fast travel whenever you want. Insane. Sick. Oh, and since we're here, I, I want to buy the one that increases my damage by 10%. Honestly speaking, I know that taking damage is easy, but at the same time, it's just... 10% is just too good. Yeah. Fuck you and your business. Oh, Kenya is not even there anymore. Kendra. Okay, equip. Wait, where is it? Here it is. He uses five slots. That's disgusting. It's so expensive. Anyways, we know where we have to go. So let's tackle that. Let's see if there's a boss fight or something that we can do business with. And then maybe after that we can... What is this? Hello there. Well, isn't that an interesting puzzle type of thingy? Ah, we have to open this up. Okay, so how do we deal with this? You can sell, send it to multiple places. Let's do this. Oh, it's sent back. Why? Can I send you over there? It, is, it gets destroyed. Fine. This is going to be bad, by the way. Who are you? Okay, one of them is down. Right, be careful with the curse. You don't understand these enemies just yet. Okay, one of them is gone. Oh! Stop it with the jumpy jumpies. Nah. Let's go. Get the blow blow. Do it. Ah, oh, fuck. The extra 10% is fucked. That, that's okay. I was expecting that during the curse. Beautiful. Avoid it. Goodbye. We did it. Let's go. We freaking did it. Alright, so let's see. 
if I want that item, okay, what needs to happen? By the way, defeat two enemy. Wait, am I losing? Hmm. So if you send this back, the problem with it is that oh, it doesn't close the door. So now we can send it back. Okay, I thought it was gonna be a little bit more complicated. Such as the door gets closed and it cannot be open or something like that. Who knows? Makes attacks 30% of stronger at low health. Upgrades can be equipped at safe shrines. Meh. I've never been a fan of anything that makes my attacks stronger when your health is low. That's too dangerous. Nope. Go hit somebody else. Shit. One more enemy and the curse is gone. We need this, guys. Come on, shit. Come on, little shit. Come on. Oh, bitch. And now the... The curse is over and we have a free upgrade slot. Where do I have to shoot this? Uh, over there. Wait. Oh, fuck. Oh, I have an idea. Yeah. That puzzle right there. Pretty clever. Pretty nice. I'm like... I, I like those type of puzzles, if I gotta be honest. Wait, wait what, what was the point of doing that? Oh, because you cannot go from here? So right now I'm trying to connect this whole place. So if I go here, where do I go? Right. So what was even the point of triggering that shortcut? Uh, I mean, this is going to keep connecting down and I see something in here. Okay. Okay, we, we got to keep walking, but... Oh, what is that? New photo. Press to view. Oh. Oh, nice! Oh, we can actually... What, what is this? It's a statue of Pearl and another frog. The other frog looks like Pebble. It's probably Pebble. Can you even run in this game? Oh, so there's no way to go faster. That's okay. That is alright. Let's keep walking and see what else is going on. Go smack somebody else. Right now, I'm not worried that... <sighs> no. 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 I thought for a second. Oh, let me let me give it a nice walk and it should be fine. Come on. Come on. Yep. Come on. Come on, buddy. He, uh... he was too slow. He, he actually was like, yeah, I don't want to touch you. But then he actually extended his arm. So you don't try to do that to me and think that you're going to get away with it. I'm just saying. Um... What happens if I shoot it over there? There's nothing. Right, so you want me where you want me to shoot it that way? Oh freak! Okay. That's actually cool. Thank you, game, for the tip. That was incredible. Ah nah. Come on. Bring it on, baby. You guys know the drill. Bye! Death to all of them! Death to all of them! Yes! Yes! No! Well... I still took that, but... You guys gotta admit that we almost did a good one on them! We almost destroyed them all. That, that would've been awesome if we didn't take damage there. Bitch. Asshole. You. Piece of... Shit. Ah. Doing enough damage so then they don't they cannot even begin their combos. Well, I guess he did try to begin. What is this? Ah. Oh, he almost fucked me up. I know that there's something that you can do in here. How? Doesn't work. Okay. Okay, sure. That's probably like some sort of like secret for a different section or something. Oh, you can actually jump the attack! Oh, that's sick. Then we get a key. We know that there's something there that we were not able to get. Oh, probably we're gonna get like a power where you can actually dig underground and get from one section to the other. Okay. Exciting to see the type of powers that you're gonna get. That's actually pretty cool. What is this? New upgrade slot phone. That's seven. Cool. We go this way. Where are we actually at? We can go down, there's nothing there. We just gotta open up that gate that we didn't really see before, but hey, now we know where to go. It's fine. Oh, that's nice. That that power over there, like whenever you like 
the, 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 the roll to attack the that one. Oh, so good. Anyways, we need this. Just a nice save so we can get our health back. And then a little bit more trash, sure. This definitely looks like one of those games where I will... How do you call this? Where I will grind <laughs> to be able to get shit. Like, I have no questions about that. Like, I know as a matter of fact that it's gonna be like, Oh, this is the first section. Okay, I'm gonna grind it to buy every single amulet that that frog over there had to offer. And then it's gonna be the next section. And I'm like, okay, is there more amulets? Yes, okay, I'm gonna grind to be able to get them. Just because... Just so just we can test new stuff and things like that. We can explore the section to the left, but honestly speaking, our way should be to the top right now, so... What is this? Um, I just love this statue. I think it looks just like her. Are you sure about that, bro? Do you know her? I did. And I miss her so, so, so much. You see, in frog culture, dying is one of the saddest things that can happen to someone, isn't it, in every culture? So now that I'm dead, I worry about her a lot. I just hope she's okay. Well, anyways, I guess I gotta go back to cleaning. Good job. Yep. Goodbye. Bitch. Anyways, which way are we supposed to go? Can explore the way to the left. There is some fire in here that we don't really want to deal with, but that's fine, I guess, as long as we are close to it. Shouldn't take damage, shouldn't receive damage. That's good. Not one of these fellas. That one goes over there. Right. And then... Next one should make it easy if we do something like that. Not really. Mm, from the bottom? Oh, okay, okay. So if I do something like this... Let's go. And then we do something like that. But this one is too slow. I cannot really... I'm not fast enough to be able to reach it. Unless I do something like that. And then... Is there any way? Maybe the solution is you send this over here. And then send this one to do one, two. Probably if you send it over here. Oh, come on. That was actually... Okay, that was actually really simple. And I was super overcomplicating it. Like, oh yeah, you have to be super fast or something like that. Well, shit happens. From here, I would guess... Yeah, let's explore the section to the right. See what type of... Oh my god, you gotta be kidding me. It's a gauntlet. You better give me something good. Bring it on, shit. Okay, who else? Is that really how you guys are gonna show me? Nope. Die. One again? Oh, hello. Did you just... Did we just annihilate the guy with our powers? That's good. And we're just standing there and we're like, okay, take the power of the broom. Middle section. Take a look at the map. Bot lot of mess. Cannot go through the top, I believe. No, you cannot go through the top. That's fine. That's fine. Everything is okay. There you go. Cannot really touch me over there. Does that shut everything off? No, it doesn't. So you have to like go back the same way. Ah God! For fuck's sake! Oh god! Oh there you game. And I thought it was gonna be an easy ride. Down or up? Either way would be dangerous. Seems like we can go down and explore a little bit more. Let's see. Ah, oh, fuck. No way, game. Not again. Okay, dodge that. Kill this guy. Beautiful. Do it. Perfection. That was just delicious. Getting an easy defeat just like that is so good. And what is this? Leaves a trail of mine behind you that hurts enemies who step on them. Special attacks can be equipped via safe trains. So that's a special attack. Um, I actually like my special attack, the one with the spirals. I don't think that that's something that I could use. 
unless it is a permanent thing and like as I walk the spines just come in and everything just blows up that would be so cool but we'll see how OP powers can get on this game what are you doing oh it's a wait is that a, is that is that wait so I thought it was like a like a worm that was no it was just a the enemy that was showing up I thought it was like a like a worm that was showing up but no, it was just a normal spider huh what happened with you Pepe Yep. Yep, yep, yep. Oh, more trash. Yes, give me all of that. Look at that. It just keeps going up. 1,200. We need like 2,000. There is some greening. Oh, we gotta keep going up. We're almost there. We're almost there, guys. There's the music change. So that's not good. We should be able to have a good day. Let's go. Little flies cannot really do much. Let's go. Anything at the bottom, just enemies. We don't really care about them. And then, gotta avoid all of this chaos. Can I go behind you? <laughs> I can. It's not such. It's not recommended. Oh, what is that? Another cat. Come on, game. Come on. That guy, Kendra, is gonna pay for making out of those cuts! Get stuck in place. Nope. Do your spin spin, that's fine. There is some locked off in here. Oh, God, there's items. Oh, wait. Oh, uh, this is a shortcut that's gonna take us right there. Oh, that's actually neat. I'll take that shortcut. So if, even if we die, we, we got a nice, a nice fantastic shortcut. That's good. We could go up, and that's a chaos, so no. But we get this place to explore, and then from here, how do you do this? Not like that. Well, I guess you could do something like this. Oh, I see what you gotta do. So you push it in there so it bounces. Right? Get that ass, whoop! Then now that it's doing that, you can go in here and get that ass going. Let's go. Give me that upgrade slot. Let's go, baby. That's an 8. There's more items over there. But to get there, we have to go from the top. That's fine. Of course, our goal right now is to try to beat the demo. If the demo is super long, then we might do multiple episodes for it. I know that by now, Grand Blue is already going. So, uh, it might be... Maybe interesting how we're gonna be putting things together. But yeah, what is this? We missed a photo. Okay. But we'll see. We'll see, we'll see. Uh, there is nothing in here. We can go up this way, sure. Nothing over there that we can reach right now. Gotta go to the right. Shit, I forget that those things are a little bit annoying because they can actually shoot from whatever they want. Yeah! Let's go. Ah, look at those combos. Just stay quiet for one second and everything just dies. That's just a connection over here. There's nothing. Probably go through the top. And I'm also liking how like there's not just one way. Like you can literally connect multiple paths together, and that's super cool. Like, for real, like, look at this. We're going this way. There's nothing that we can do. But then we can go from the bottom. Look at that. Look at those combos. Oh, baby. Let's go. And what is this? Another Peppa? Sure. This Pebbles is... A what is that? I want that. How do I get that? Wait, how do you get that? Maybe from the bottom? Right, so you trigger this. That's a shortcut, so that way you can just go down if you want to. But that doesn't really help unless you want to go through the top. We already cleansed that, so we don't really care about that. Now, for us to trigger this, we must be missing something. That looks like a really sick power that I want to get eventually. So I wonder how we're going to be getting that. Okay, really curious. Probably a power for a different time. Let's see what else is going on. Yes. 
and we equip stuff. Yeah, we're gonna be equipping. Look at this special arts, but that's a problem. Like, you have to equip one or the other. I don't really like those. Uh, this one is cheap, so we're gonna equip them both. And then over here, how much cash do we have now? No, we want the 2000 plus. So over here, we can go through the top and connect here. We can go super top. Let's see if there's something that we missed over here. Probably yes. Just a gauntlet. That's fine. Bring it on. The way that those gauntlets trigger reminds me a lot of... What is the name of this game? Um, Cult of the Lamp. I don't know. There's something about it that reminds me a lot of that game. Just saying. Maybe also the way that you hit and the chaos that happens whenever you destroy things. It's really similar to the way that Cult of the Lamp works. Just, just a thought. Just a thought right there that I had. Uh, we can go down. Yeah, there's no... There's no real connection to anything that you can do in here. So definitely a power that we may be missing. It definitely, but based on what I'm seeing, is the power of digging. Like, you probably can go under some surfaces. That's just my guess. Anyways. Could have been here sooner had I um, come this way first. Anyways, give me that. Another broom. Thing is, Pebbles broom. It looks like she dropped it. Oh, shit. Can you grab it? Why don't you get a stronger broom? Like, fuse them together, bro. First boss fight. Pot full of spiders. Disgusting. Anyway, show me what you got. Oh, no, 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 no! Oh, wait, the spiders hit me! Fuck. Okay, just jump them. Jump them. It's a bullet kill type of battle. That's cool. But don't touch me. Not like that. Ah. I hope you don't like this. No. This is actually... Oh, God. Okay, that's some good damage right there. Now we gotta be careful with this. Bullet kill this type of power. Ha ah, ha. I need a healing, bro. What is that? What is that? No, no, no! Whoa, whoa! It's so awesome. Ah, oh, third face! No, no third face! What's happening? She's not having it! Ah, get away from me! Let's go! I can use the pot! Shit, that's a lot of damage, but I can't just not hit you up! Kill him! Yes! Right on time! Baby, first try! Thank you for that, like, extra damage when my health is low. Pepe, what happened to you? Pebble, are you okay? Oh. Oh, yeah, I think so. I was just trying to clean some grim off that pot and I guess I fell in. I should probably go outside a bit anyways. Being here in this shrine for too long always brings me down. You know, I don't mind being stuck inside of the palace most of the times. So what? Oh, outside of the palace. Yeah. But I wish I could go inside just once so I could see Pearl again. Wait. I thought you said she was still alive. Is she in the palace? Oh, you don't know? There's something very special inside of the palace. It's a mirror made of crystal soul. Any ghost who steps inside of the mirror can visit Earth again just for a moment. The living won't be able to see you. But you can at least feel their presence again. And maybe they can feel yours as well. But, I guess it is not really worth thinking about that thing. After all, we're stuck out here forever, so getting used, getting used to the crystal mirror is totally impossible. Guess I could just get back to cleaning then. Thanks again for helping me back there. And we have a new friend. I mean, I don't understand the point of it, but sure. And I have something for you. Uh, it is in the room just north of here. You can go and grab it. So what do we get? New power? Press while in the air to air dash. Beautiful. So I kind of figured there was going to be something like that. Air dash is always cool. The, pala the play grits. Dear Pearl. Wait, fuck. May we see each other again. Someday. Love Pebble. Oh, adorable. That's so cool, but now we have powers, now we can access other areas, that's pretty cool. 
And hey, the demo isn't over yet. That's impressive. Oh, because we haven't reached this section. Right. That's fine. We can reach that area. We can go over there. We got something to reach, so let's reach it. And oh wait, how do we even reach that? Like, if you want to get to it... Oh, we're going to have to go over here. Oh, maybe it's because we got blocked off because of the battle that we need to do. And what is that? Boom. But boss rush mode has been unlocked. Any boss that has been defeated in-game can be replayed on this mod. Okay, sure. This marks the end of the main content for this demo. But there is a lot more to explore if you like to keep playing. Please, wishlist Crypt of the Custodian on... Yeah, of course. This game, this game actually looks pretty cool. So we're going to be giving it a shot. Anyways, you guys can let me know in the comment section down below how much do you guys enjoy the game. If this is something that you guys are interested in watching or what the deal is. The game looks absolutely incredible. I feel like those... Um, there is a lot to it and based on what I'm seeing on that background there is gonna be way too much like pressure and this game is just like it's gonna be so much fun I had fun with it so anyways I hope that you guys enjoyed it thanks a lot for watching as always and with that said see y'all in the next one